The duckbill Corythosaurus is easily distinguished by the feature for which it was named, the helmet-like crest atop its head. The head of Corythosaurus is high, narrow, and compressed from side to side. The front of the mouth was covered by a horny beak. Inside the mouth, as in other duckbills, was an enormous battery of more than 600 teeth. There were up to 43 rows of teeth in the upper jaw. The lower jaw was deep and massive, and had 37 tooth rows. Fossilized skin impressions show that Corythosaurus had elaborate skin patterns. There were numerous armor plates on Corythosaurus skin. The largest was about 38 millimeters long, 32 millimeters wide, and 8 millimeters high. Corythosaurus was a sizable animal, weighing perhaps 2 tons or more. It ran on two legs and balanced itself with its horizontally held tail. A number of species have been referred to Corythosaurus over the years. All of them are now known to belong to the type species. The differences originally perceived between these species are due to age, sex, or individual variation.